Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Aquarius, January 14, 2023. Mars turns direct today, after retrograde motion since late October. This shift of direction brings forward movement to money, gifts, bonuses, family, domestic matters, and personal talents. Ideally, delays in these areas in recent weeks lead to rerouting that helps you understand your situation and desires more clearly. You now have more emotional fuel for enjoying and pursuing your interests. While your personal life remains busy, it's a straightforward kind of busy that you can handle. When problems exist, dealing with them is far easier when you know exactly what they are. Recent complications related to family, living conditions, or home life are expected to smooth out. A venture might pick up the pace, reach a turning point, or resume. Today, ease into things. There is no need to rush as the shift occurs. Welcome a new horizon with open arms. This is a major turning point in the year. Mighty Mars, the red planet of passion, sex, and anger, was in the deep trenches of a retrograde phase in the skies of Gemini. Mars began to slow down in the summer, stationed retrograde on Halloween, and is finally stationary in the skies. Each day going forward he will begin to pick up the pace and help you sort out any drama or hiccups that happened. Pat yourself on the back. You're a survivor. You've made it through the heaviest part of the storm. Be confident in the value of your uniqueness. You may need to do a little self-reflection to heal any inhibitions that you may have regarding your quirks that could be an asset in your profession when Venus in Aquarius sextiles Chiron in Aries. Part of this could be exploring your curiosities with an open mind at work when Mars stations direct in Gemini later today. Both transits can help you move forward with more certainty about what you may want to pursue and the supposed value of looking into said possibilities. It is just as the dwarf planet Eris is spending her first full day in direct motion in your income sector that the asteroid Juno, the queen of commitment returns for her first visit in four years. In a case of perfect timing, this will see a sense of resolve kick in just as income potential gets the green light. A busy day for the money gods will also see the moon return for its first visit to your financial sector for the year, with a chance to check in on money matters. Learn all you can about maintaining optimal health. Food choices and exercise are of course daily concerns, but it would also pay to develop a knowledge base about the functioning of your internal organs. Do you know much about your colon and how to keep it healthy? Do you know how to take care of your kidneys with proper hydration? There is abundant information on the web take advantage and start feeling even better than you do, at your best. You may discover many differences and innovative methods in which your family may explore their past in the present. This day offers you a boost to your artistic talents and expressiveness. Your main focus if often family and children. Through your creative and nurturing attitude you will be more than able to communicate what you see as your true priorities in life. This day encourages you to deal with the areas in your life that you feel are of immediate concern. For the second time in as many days, another of the four planets that began the year in retrograde motion is turning direct. This time, just a day after Eris' direct turn in your income sector gave income potential and Jupiter's quest for income growth and expansion the green light, Mars turns direct in your home and family sector. With Mars not leaving until March but no longer focused on the past, as things close to home get the green light this will unleash the drive to make things happen and get things done. It is just a few hours before the asteroid Juno, the queen of commitment and especially commitment to your relationships leaves Pisces today that the moon will wrap up its last visit to your relationship sector for the year. Even a clash between the two before leaving will work to your advantage, with a chance to flush out what you want from your relationships and what they need from you. Our eyes in the sky. Action planet Mars turns direct in Gemini this afternoon, ending the retrograde story that began on October 30, 2022. We could feel a bit frustrated and out of sorts as Mars begins to wind down from its planetary moonwalk. However, 
We're just feeling the tail end of drama that we've been dealing with for months. Our energy can now be restored and revived for the first time in a long while. You find work-related issues easy to handle and using your alert and active mind you apply fresh impetus to projects that require concentrated team effort. You encounter very few obstacles in your personal life. Whatever you choose to focus your attention on others are enthused by your innovative approach and appreciate the concerted effort you make. Your ability to understand any situation is good and you're able to undertake any sort of mental task. Equally, you're communicating without any difficulty, so possible negotiations or similar conversations turn out to be successful. You also find your general level of curiosity is heightened and you're keen to acquire knowledge and learn as much as you can. If you enjoy buying yourself something new, go ahead and do it. You have the means to do so, and it's about time you treated yourself. Your finances allow you to make a small investment and you are sensible enough not to overspend. Get out and strut your stuff. Feeling attractive, you're easily persuaded to make the most of your looks with a visit to the hairdresser or the health club. You're amazed at the transformation. Feeling even more appealing, when you meet up with others your attractiveness shines through, you're aware how people notice you, it's not your imagination. Mid-morning, Venus in Aquarius sextiles Chiron in Aries, helping to heal our hearts. Today's interactions stimulate reminders of wounds experienced in past relationships. It may not be a romantic wound, but a platonic one. Perhaps the betrayal of a friend, or being ostracized from a social circle. Yet today, the trigger feels softer. The lessons imparted are gentler. We might find ourselves entrenched in a similar dynamic with a friend who keeps us on the outs. Yet we can see that this is not the kind of alliance we wish to have in our lives. Alternatively, it may be that we are now part of the in crowd. We can welcome someone into our sphere and thus repair some of the karmic damage we incurred in our youth. Intensify contacts to people, because they find you particularly likable right now. Plan your leisure time with family and good friends and most importantly, make your plans together. You might feel like ringing up an old friend, the time is perfect to revive and strengthen old ties. This will make it easy for you to make new contacts and maybe even lifelong friendships. In the early afternoon, Mars stations direct after nearly two and a half months of being retrograde. During this time, we have had to contest with stalled projects, low libidos, weakened immune systems, and an inability to achieve progress in the causes that are important to us. Finally, these issues start to fall away as Mars begins its forward march. Take a mental inventory of the past few months and note lessons learned. We may have discovered that we were putting our energy behind work initiatives or relationships that were not worth the effort. Having received a clearer picture, we can proceed in the arenas where our actions are able to make a real impact.